on a festival may be eaten on the same day, so, say the school of Shammai, the school of Hillel, say it must not, the school of Shammai say that leaven the size of an olive and leavened bread the size of a date, are to be removed before Passover, but the school of Hillel, say that both must be removed when of the size of an olive only, if, wild game or fowl is to be slaughtered on a...
Nash. Or maybe, uh, you want, what do you want? You like chant or what do you like to eat? Attention all listeners of this song in the far future who are digging through the forgotten band Kemp albums of the past in search of samples, please sample the following sound, so my legacy can live on forever. I already know that this sample will be heard on popular radio in the future, so consider yourself lucky to be one of the few people who have heard this project and will get the opportunity to make millions of dollars off of the following sound which will revolutionize the future of popular music. So you like you like basketball? You play a lot of basketball? Thank you. Now back to the music. Zadok Gadol by. <laughs>
I got the honey, the chocolate dip honey cookies with honey in the middle. Nothing says come to me on Rosh Hashanah, right? Anyone who knows about it, what here about women, you know a little bit about women, you're supposed to go to your Rosh Hashanah and whatnot. Rabbi Nachman says, come to me Rosh Hashanah. He's the Rosh B'nai Yisrael, the Tzaddik, okay? Rabbi Jehoshua and Rabbi Papis attested that the offspring of a peace offering may be offered as a peace offering, now. As the sages hold so against Rabbi Elizer who maintains the opposite, said Rabbi Papis, I attest that we ourselves had a cow of a peace offering which we ate on Passover, and whose offspring we consumed the next tabernacle likewise as a peace offering.